Someone paid $60 for three long spikes. Headdresses for $366. Hey everyone, and today I'm a purple lad. I don't know why I'm a purple lad, but whatever. Today is a different kind of video. We're going to be looking at high animal jam prices on eBay. Like, they're crazy. So I wanted to share them with you guys. And also, this video is kind of a warning to new jammers. Why is there an eagle dancing next to me? <laughs> this video is kind of a warning to new jammers because recently a lot of popular animal jam tubers and stuff have been removed because they have sold items or bought items on eBay kind of thing. So this is kind of like a warning, so don't do this. It's just kind of to show the extreme prices people will pay and then their accounts will get removed. So let's hop straight onto eBay. Okay, let's look for animal jam. Hmm, spike is the first thing, so I guess we'll look for animal jam spike. Well, there's like a homemade spike. This information is useless. We need to be, oh, that's kind of cool though. So we need to be looking at the sold listings to see how much people have actually paid for these things. $20 for a spike, 15, 20, 40. Someone's paid $60 for three long spikes. This is crazy. This could literally just be a screenshot of someone's account and then they've used it and not given them their items. Like imagine that, imagine giving 60 bucks and then not getting your items. This one has a koala on it. Ooh. It mind boggles me that people would actually spend this much on like pixels, like, huh? This set to the most recent listing first and that was like this month. Like people are still doing this. So let's go for the highest price and see how much people, oh my God, that is a lot. Let's just search animal gem. $411 and there's not even a picture? What is it? This listing is for one blue headdress, one green and black headdress. You could literally just write on your notes and upload that on eBay. Oh my god, and they put their username. I wonder if they're still like a jammer. That is so bad. So someone paid $400 for this, this, this. And the seller just put the, the when is bid wedding bidder's username in there just so they could get banned that that is crazy let's carry on we have two headdresses for 366 dollars their account is literally called selling rares let's have a look items for sale oh they, they just sell clothes now <laughs> well i guess animal jam got rid of their account but what the heck people actually paid these are sold listings people actually bought these for like 200 bucks like it's, it's just pixels, like, huh? And here we have someone pretending to be Beppa. They probably just took a screenshot of Beppa's, like, video, you know what I mean? Oh, this listing was removed. Okay, that's good. So no one actually bought that one. Oh, is their username there? Huh? This is crazy, dude. I like their pet, though. It's really kind of cute. <laughs> they used the den picture. That's unique. Huh. Oh. Let's search Animal Jam. Hmm. Animal Jam Res? Or Animal Jam Coat? Animal Jam Res. Yeah, these are pretty much what we just looked at earlier. Hmm. Let's look at the Animal Jam Codes one. Because that's technically not breaking the rules because it's the code and they haven't been on the site yet. But you know what I mean? It's still not right. $300 for figures and codes. Huh? Surely you could just buy like a whole lot of the blind bag figures and you would get the same amount for paying less. Do you know what I mean? Okay, let's carry it on down. Yeah, you could probably get a whole case of that for like that much and they've paid $300. <laughs> that makes zero sense. Okay, that's... Oh, oh, these must be wave two, right? They look different. I haven't seen those yet. <laughs> huh. Oh, it's like a pouch. That's pretty cool. But yeah, all there is here like is toys and stuff. So yeah, let's go back to Animal Jam. So yeah, that was a lot of money for like pixels, you know what I mean? It is not worth selling your rare items because they will find out and they will delete your account and the other person's account and the items will be gone forever. So if you're going to be like trading things, just trade within games, don't use real money because it is against the Animal Jam rules. A lot of people have been removed because of this recently, it's just kind of like a warning thing. 
Um, but yeah, I still can't believe people were paying like 400 bucks for things like, huh? It's collars and hats and accessories for digital pets, like, huh? But whatever they want to spend their hard-earned money on, or uh, whatever. <laughs> or whatever. Um, so yeah, if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and give it a like and comment down below, like, what do you think on people selling items? Do you think it's wrong? Would you do it? Have you done it? Hmm? 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 Let me know in the comments below and I'll see you guys next time in my next video. Bye guys!